Hello and welcome to ALW Exploration. This is the abandoned school. This is Elms Primary and Nursery School in Nottingham, England. Opening in 1946 as troops were returning from the Second World War, the school was built to serve a growing demand for school places in the area. Serving as a place of learning and development for children between the years of 3 to 11, this large Georgian era building holds many interesting features in its architecture. Elms Primary served the Mapley Parish for 62 years before being suddenly closed during a restructure of Nottinghamshire's primary school properties in 2008. Before the closure, the school had a good rating on the last Ofsted report. The final head teacher was a Miss J. O. Smith. Sitting dormant for many years, the council issued a £500,000 contract in June 2017 to remove the surface asbestos and to partially demolish the school and caretaker's house. The contractor started the work but found much more asbestos in the building ducts and voids than previously known about. Holes were cut in the floor and all the asbestos removed. Due to the rising costs, the £500,000 was spent wholly on making the building safe and demolition was never started. An extra £350,000 was also approved to make the building asbestos free. 2020 brought the government restrictions and during this a developer, Blueprint Limited, a regeneration development company, was due to submit a planning application to build 75 homes on the site. Got the sports hall here. Oh, look at this, like Russian style front window. Looks really cool. It's Paul taking a long exposure. F4.5, probably about right. ISO 100. Shoot a speed of 2. That's probably really good. That's good, that. Tripod wants to be up a bit, I think. Yeah, change the lens. Yeah. So let's have a little look around then. So this looks like, reminds me of Grange Hill, this. Yeah. The sort of offset atrium. So this was a classroom, so we've got the boards on here, fire action, that's quite a modern fire action sign, and then the board here, a blackboard and then they called them whiteboards, but yeah this was, you can see where it was on there. Uh, teacher's store cupboard. This looks like it was an office because it's got a fireplace. Idiots have been and set fire to some wallpaper. We've got lots of book storage there. And again there. Nice fireplace though, all tiled. Room. Not to be used as storage. Which room that was that? I think that was this room. Looks quite stripped out. Yeah, some gold trunk there. This has been the switch room. Oh look at the skylight, that's quite nice. So what's that? Children. Children of the third millennium, it says on there. I don't know if you can read that. Let's go down these stairs. Okay, massive rooms down there. This looks 
like it was the uh, school office. First aid room. You come here when you put your finger. Have a look down here then. Oh, big hole in the floor. All of them skylights. Brilliant. This was the art store. Various little rooms. Oh, clues on what this one was then. Don't know what room that was. Hmm. Watch out for these boards. So I've got another gym hall here. Paul, watch out there, mate. I won't go in there, they'll see you. So this is the infant's area now that we're in. I'll turn the light off so I don't give my position away. What else we got here? It's such a big place this. It's one of them locations that you know you could say it keeps on giving. So this looks like it was the dining room. Nice. Wonder what's for breakfast. That was the kitchen area. Scaffold only. Storeroom. Paints. Go look at the floor board up. Books, paints, paint palettes, construction, popoids, electrical distribution board there, last tested in uh, four. See someone's been in stripping these to take the radiators out. They've been disturbed by the look of it. Getting some shots of the uh, kitchen area. That's pretty cool to be fair, isn't it? That is pretty cool to be fair. Wow. That's the full kitchen area for the infants, I believe. Yeah, that is a shame. It's been totally stripped out. Staff on the areas, but look at that big, big corridor there. Oh, no. What a disabled area toilet. You look to you, Drew. I can't draw it inside. What the frick is that? What's that? If you know what that's for, please leave a comment. But these steps are massive. Look, the like the height of my leg. Stepping up like that. That's nuts. I've never seen anything like that before. And then down there is a bike pit. There's obviously been a problem since Westboro Road. There's must be one. There's got to have been all asbestos in there underneath. But what's that? I don't know what that is. I've never seen a room like that before. Never seen anything like that before. Because the steps are too big to walk up. Especially children. Did you say staff are only? Staff are only. Maybe it's a secret meeting room. Maybe. I don't know. The changing area. Oh, have you seen that in there? I can see some of it. Somebody wrote something. Oh, that's really nice. 
guess that. And some idiots wrote stupid stuff on. That's really nice. There'll be, hopefully, there'll be a student who went to this school who remembers this. Oh, that's really cool. This snake. It's got the height. I'll see how tall I look. How tall am I? I think I'm about 190 something. I can't go back to it because I've got a backpack on. I think I'm about 190. Leave a comment, how tall am I? God, you're always noisy. Everywhere I go, this man is always noisy. Got changing rooms, I think. Oh, kids' toilets. I took the toilets away though. I like the way they were little cubicles. But I really like that art. Not really. I think that's a koala. What do koalas have tails? Can someone tell me what that is? I don't know what that is. And the Patterson. Big classroom there. That is big. Welcome to class two. Nice. Little store covered in the corner. See this primary school I went to had windows inside like this. They had like corridors with glass. Then we've got the classroom. The blackboard. And each classroom seems to have its own store cupboard. Lower play group. I like that music. Rainbow. It's nice, a bit more natural light in here. Idiots have been smashing the windows. Had a good hide in this place, sadly. I bumped all the radiators in there. It's like it's been half set up for demolition, and then they just give up. I don't know what these are. Big store cupboards. It's where they used to have the TV on wheels up there. Oh, we've got a set of stairs there. Got another classroom. I think it's a classroom. Yeah, it's a big classroom, isn't it? Can you write about and then the alphabet on there? A ladder. And things are going down. Like this area. See, this has been since for the kids, the way they go down. Oh, toilet there, the toilets. And they're the little basins washing their hands. Radiator. Smash up toilet. Idiots have been in. Gotta be careful of all the glass coming out. Looks like they've laminated it with plastic. Holding it all together. Central star area. I've covered it to stop kids falling as far. So we're now went now at the other end of that long corridor. I think there'll be more classrooms through here. Yeah, lots more classrooms. All in a similar sorry state unfortunately. Be a water watcher. Save water now. There's been a water leak in here. The actual skylight itself has been removed. This looks like it was an office.
toilet area. And this looks a bit interesting because it's got like a partition in it. So what's the way of that? Oh right, those are the men's toilets. Presuming these are the girls' toilets. Must be a lot more boys than girls. I'll break that wall up there. That's crazy. We rolled it and bricked it up. And then Yes, they must have changed this into a big changing room. This way. Big long corridors. What a view. We'll try and get in the boiler room in a bit, so keep watching. Because there is a big central plant boiler down there. I don't know if you can see through the metal. But there is, believe me, it's down there. Big boiler room. So, Wednesday the 20th of September. Miss Mason. So they're still writing on the board from when this was a school. And then I believe we got to about here when we came upstairs the other way. Is this another sports hall? Is this what floor are we on now? We're back on the ground floor. I can't remember going back downstairs. Oh yeah, we're upstairs, yeah that's it. The sports hall's upstairs. It's like built over two levels. This is a bit of an unusual explore for me. I don't, don't I've never done a school before but the opportunity presented itself, so here we are. School it is. This school is a vast labyrinth of corridors and rooms, which all had a story to tell. It is such a shame that buildings like this cannot be reused for future use. Due to the global situation last year, the plans for redevelopment slowed down and the future of this school are once again paused for now. No, just don't stand on these. Gym? Yeah, back in the gym, yeah. I like the gym. I hated gym at school though. Um, yeah, it's like heating pipes, yeah. It smells of uh, heating, heating pipes. So. They've got hockey sticks, quick cricket wooden bats, rounders, tennis, skittles and swing ball. But this here was right here. I've got to be careful where I stand here. This is a Hager distribution board. These, these are 40 pound ago. These are CBOs. And there's, you know, a load of them. They're quite modern. No, they're not they're not like really old um, again this one and it's got times up there here with time switches this was all done as a update in 2004 so they spent some money on it then closed it okay so this bit being on fire some more skylights here yeah a bit trashed some idiot set fire to it. Well, there's more. Right, I'm gonna have to be careful going over this because I don't want to make loads of noise. If it all moves, I'm like a right racket. Oh, no, no. 
don't see how much mud noise Paul makes when he walks over it. Ah, that was noisy. <laughs> This has been smashed a bit. This really needs the shape and back there to pop down to put that freshness back. <laughs> but this is what I don't get. We always come to places and we're super quiet, but somebody hasn't. They've come here and smashed it to bits. How would he do that? I don't get it. Yeah, I brought that base in though. He just pulled it off the wall and dumped it. Now look, the stick man getting changed, look. Don't want to get anything changed in there though. area so this would have been the maintenance man's room but, uh, that's that thing called brake tank electrical distribution so in here we've got an expansion vessel that is a boiler a twin twin boiler so that's been a big one what brand that is, what's it do? I'll service it. MHS. So, exploring Dave, you're required to give that a service. And we've got the uh, system here, system pumps. Got another expansion there, but that's for potable water, which is uh, wholesome water, which is for drinking or bathing in. That is a hot water cylinder that's the immersion heater there and then all the takeoffs on top now the metal thieves have missed a trick here because that's stainless that's a stainless tank This was oh, Daily Star Wednesday the 11th of August 2010, so it's only 11 years ago. Oh, if you haven't already, if you haven't already viewers, can you please subscribe to the channel, so it really helps me out when you do that. And you'll uh, receive new videos every Thursday, totally free. Big canopy for you inside the school. stepping stones and the kids playground got the numbers there and the concrete for jumping on the snake the only thing you throw the ball at the ball comes through the different colour hoop Thank you so much for watching this ALW exploration video. Please subscribe and share.
we will be back each Thursday with a new video. Bye bye for now.